Hi, how you doing? So as many of my subscribers know, <clears throat> I usually give the details of the experiments that I do, and sometimes I don't give all the details. And there's a reason for that, for you to apply what your knowledge is from your area and where you live. That also goes for the data that maybe has been applied in your area to try and get a bit of difference of applications, you could say. This world is all connected through the internet these days, but data doesn't always appear to be the same in different areas. The experiment that I showed yesterday, some of you might think that's an impossibility. I did a lot of research into stuff in the 18 and 1900s. There's a lot of stuff that was done. Now, if that seems really far-fetched in that video yesterday, you haven't seen some of the stuff that was being done. There's a lot of stuff that was forbidden publications and a lot of research way back when. And today, we have a lot of censoring going on in social media and videos and Being straightforward in a lot of stuff, giving detailed step-by-step -step of how to accomplish this and that isn't always a good thing. So getting observations from different areas and seeing what happens could sometimes be useful. I do a lot of stuff that's sorting out what was done when all the energy stuff was being written. Uh, of course, I don't know everything with stuff. But there's a lot of deciphering that goes on and a lot of mental challenge and trying to sort out the head games that were being done from way back in the day when the whole education system was being put together. A century ahead in time, most people today can't discern what's being done to them by data collection and how that data is being used to keep you in the situation where you are now. Trying to point out certain things is sometimes difficult because you got government retaliation for for sharing information. Heck, I've been going through hell since doing some of the research that I did. It's just unreal, the stuff that's going on. It's like This, this this country has been under a communist social rule in the United States and the people can't seem to discern that they're not free, they're living in communism. It's not a democratic society. I hate to get into politics type stuff, but this type of sorting stuff out, having to figure out what's going on with things is a very challenging situation when you got data collection systems that are being used against you on a daily basis. You can't even get away from this stuff because it's 
it's everywhere and it makes it very difficult for researchers to move ahead with what they're doing when you got continuous holdups in the background by this data disbursement without you really being able to discern that you're being fucked with by this system that's been put in place with the phones and the demanding of the phones on a continuous basis. It's like your phone is continuously whining and carrying on <clears throat> all day long. People seem to accept their phones as being, I don't know, like a family member or something that you got to continuously cater to to keep that phone happy. The future of this world doesn't look good. Put it that way. Thanks for watching.